Hey everyone, thanks for watching. Today we're going to take a look at Cisco's event notification service. This allows you to get end of life announcements, end of sale announcements, uh, bug uh, you know, announcements, whenever there's something key in your Cisco environment that you want to get notified about, uh, this is the service that will do it. So uh, anyway, let's dive in and check it out firsthand. Here you can see the tools and resources page on cisco.com. You can get to this by logging in. Uh, use your cisco.com credentials. Look for the Cisco event notification service. You'll be redirected to the notification service itself. Uh, you'll land at a screen that looks something like this. It's pretty straightforward. You'll see I actually have a uh, two different notifications already configured for 36 and 3850 series switches. Uh, to add a notification, click Add Notification. Choose if you want to track a uh, product-centric or alert-centric or even track a specific bug ID. Uh, you can see uh, those options here. I'm going to choose product-centric. I want to watch 2900 series routers. So I do do that. Uh, 2900 series integrated service router. I can monitor for specific models or I can just monitor all of them. So I'll do that. I want to keep tabs on end of sale and end of life announcements uh, as well as security advisories. You can watch for critical, high impact, you know, so on and so forth. A uh, number of other options here. Uh, I'm just going to go with those for now. On the next screen you'll come to the detailed setup. I want to just use username at domain Dot com as my email address. Uh, you can choose to get emails with links and summaries, just the links, uh, as well as RSS uh, information. You can choose to get these daily, or weekly, or monthly. Uh, I'm going to go with just monthly. You can see again an opportunity to prune back your uh, notifications here, and you can then hit finish when you're satisfied with those results. This will redirect you back to the landing page. And as you can see, we now have the 2900 series integrated service router listed in our notifications. If I wanted to delete this event or delete this notification, I can simply use the X. If I want to edit it, I can use the page with the pencil. And if I wanted to make a copy and then change some settings, I could use the copy setting. So I'm pretty happy with this. Let's, uh, let's go with it. Last but not least, if you need to renew these, these alerts are good for one year. If you need to renew, you can hit renew, and it'll notify you that, hey, they've been renewed. In this case, they're all already renewed since I just created them, uh, so we don't, uh, we're not able to use that. But, uh, but anyway, hopefully that's a great, you know, quick intro to the notification service. Um, feel free to check it out, poke around at the options. Uh, let me know in the comment section below what you think and how you have used this. And uh, I want to thank you for watching. We'll see you again soon.